Hey guys, it's Mandy. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a day. So rather than on Wednesdays we wear pink, we're gonna do, I'm gonna ramble Wednesday. Oh no. Ah, today was the day that I tried the armatures, but I also woke up really, really sick. So I was really sick, and I don't really know why I decided to try her armatures on a day when I woke up sick, but I did. There she is. Obviously, she's still here. Um, I just got out of the bath. So I was really sick. So I didn't feel that good, but I thought, you know, I'm home from work. Let's try to do this. How hard can it be? Very hard. Um, so I took her apart and the glass beads in her just went everywhere. And um, um, I quickly figured out that the glass beads were not going to be a good option for me to like put back in her to reweigh her with um, because I got super anxious and worried that my cats would get those um, in their paws. So um, I uh, poured the glass beads from her limbs into a container and then um, there were um, one, I think some had come loose somewhere. Um, and so they ended up um, just kind of like being everywhere. Um, and I think that was from when I took the weight out of her head. So I thought, okay, glass beads not going to work. So I was talking to Penny, and she suggested BBs, like metal BBs. Now, obviously, I can't ever take her through, like, a metal detector, but that's okay. I mean, I don't foresee taking her on a plane with me. Um, if I ever did travel with a doll, it would be one of my really little ones. Um, not this big, chunky girl. Um, so anyway, I got BBs. I got two new bags of polyfill. I decided to replace all of her polyfill just because of um, some of those loose beads had gotten into that polyfill and again I was just worried about my cats. So I got two bags of polyfill. I got the BBs and so I um, started again and um, I got the armatures in. So I got the armatures in. They're not in her now. I'll put it that way. And I'm sorry I didn't film it. It just, if you guys could have seen the absolute mess that I was working with as far as like trying to keep all of these tiny little bits from going everywhere. I closed my cats out of my room. I was using um, like a spread of, um, of black... Uh, trash bag so I could see everything if it rolled away. Um, so I got them in and it took me probably a good hour and a half to get them in. And keep in mind that I'm sick while I'm doing this so I have to keep stopping. And um, it just, it was so awful because those armatures kept buckling. And even though I was doing everything right, I looked up tutorials, I had talked to Nicole, I had talked to Penny, um, you know, previously to trying. And so I knew I was doing everything right, but the armatures just kept buckling in on themselves and her limbs kept coming out of their sockets, out of, you know, the, the, the body while I'm trying to do this. And finally I get all of them on and I hated them. I hated them. I hate how she felt with them. Um, she still would not stand. Um, because the armature that I had ordered for her, 
um, it, it just, the spine just kept buckling inside of her. And so she wouldn't, she could no longer even sit. All she could do was lay. And she is, you know, she's, she's so cute. She's a big girl. I don't want her laying like a, like a baby, like a newborn. Um, it, anytime I would have handled her, um, I would have had to completely readjust her all over again every time I handled her. And I did not want that because I've got a pretty close bond with this baby. I've already bonded with her. And so I did not want that to kind of like, I don't know, to take away her realism because she's very, very realistic. She really, really is. She's very, very realistic. So, um, what I ended up doing was I had to take her apart all over again. I had to take the armatures out and I had to take all of the stuffing out again to get the armatures out. I had to redo her weight. I decided I did want her lighter than she was originally. Um, she's now about 10 pounds. Um, she was originally about 13 or so. She was pretty heavy. Um, and then I got her restuffed. I made her the exact way I wanted her. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but this little belly is chunky as can be. Do you guys see this belly? See that? <laughs> it's so chunky. And her little behind is all nice and, and fat. <laughs> she is very, 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 very chunky. Look at that. <laughs> her belly matches the rest of her now because, you know, those thighs are... Those are some huge thighs, so now she's got a chunky little belly to match. Um, and I love it. I love I love how I've done her. Um, I just, she's so cute. I think she's perfect now. So, there will be no armatures in Kathani. There never will be. I'm never using armatures again. I'm never trying them again. I'm never having them unless the doll already comes with them installed. Um, but as far as this girl goes right here, I think she is perfect. Oh, look at her, you guys. She's being shy. <laughs> I think she's perfect the way that she is. She is absolutely perfect the way that she is. She does not need the armatures. I've got, she is stuffed and weighed exactly the way I want her. She is so, so beautiful. And so I'm just, I'm not. If I never see an armature again, it will be too soon. That is how bad this experience was. I have, uh, I have fibromyalgia and I also have some rheumatoid arthritis and I, my hands, I took some leave. My hands and my arms, like the tendons in my arms are all cramping. Um, I had to take painkiller as soon as I was done with her because my back was just one giant knot. I, could, I couldn't even stand up straight. I went and sat in my recliner with my heating in my recliner on and just laid here. And like I said, I was sick. So I kept getting sick to my stomach. Um, so, yeah, that's my, that's my rambling Wednesday. Maybe I'll make this a regular thing. Um, I still want to do, um, on Wednesdays we wear pink sometimes, but maybe like twice a month I'll just sit here and hold a doll and we'll just talk. You guys can let me know what you think. Do you like this? And then maybe next time I'll have like a cup of tea or coffee with me. Right now I've got a bottle of water and the baby. I'll always have a baby. That, that, that'll always be it. There'll always be a baby. So, anyway... Look at her little hand. She's just like, Mom, Mom, stop. <laughs> I love her so much. <laughs> anyway, you guys, I'm going to let you go. It's been a long day. I kind of still want to do some Bible journaling, so I think I'll do that. I, I need to do that because I need to settle. <laughs> things to settle down. 
All right, guys, I love you. Take care. Take care of each other. Kathani loves you, too. Can you say bye, Kathani? Can you say bye? No, she's not going to say goodbye. She's so... <laughs> I love her. All right, guys, bye.